across southern West Virginia. Good news is we are turning mostly dry for tonight, even to the first half of the day tomorrow before changes are in the forecast once again as we go towards the later tomorrow evening. Temperatures again, we're above average for this time of the year. Should be in those low 40s, reach 50 degrees out of the Beckley region, so we'll take that for the middle of February. And temperatures are going to continue to cool down though as we go into next week. But right now, feeling pretty pleasant out there, sitting in those upper 40s to low 50s. 50 in Lewisburg, 45 in Marlinton, 46 in Summersville, 48 degrees as you go into Oak Hill. 50 right now in Pine Stem, 50 as you go into Welch. Like I said, good, good news is we are staying mostly dry. I see a couple of sprinkles out there for your six o'clock hour, but for the most part, staying mostly dry out there for the rest of the night. But as we look back towards our west, seeing our next storm system pushing through Texas into Oklahoma, seeing some heavy showers across Oklahoma, even seeing some snow showers across Texas. That's going to continue pushing southwest to northeast, bringing us a chance for some rain, possibly some snow showers in the forecast as we go over the next couple of days. Looking at those chances of precipitation over the next week, we are seeing those rain chances coming back to the forecast as we go towards later Monday to Monday evening. Then we could transition to a few snow showers early Tuesday morning. Then as we go towards the middle of next week, turning mostly dry before seeing a rain or snow shower coming back once again as we go towards the end of next week. So this is how it times out on our future cast, expecting a mostly decent overnight ahead. Lots of cloud cover in the forecast, keeping those temperatures relatively warmer as we're waking up for school and work tomorrow morning. But the good news is we should stay mainly dry out there, but changes come back to the forecast starting later Monday afternoon as we're seeing another round of rain coming back into the forecast. Could be heavy out there at times. Then take a look as we go early into Tuesday morning. That rain transitions to a few snow showers early Tuesday morning. Could come down at a heavy rate out there right before the Tuesday morning commute before quickly moving out of the region Tuesday afternoon. Staying mostly dry Tuesday evening, even into Wednesday. Looking at those snowfall totals as we go into Monday, really not talking too much across the region. We're seeing a general inch or less across the entire area. You have to go above 2,500 feet. That's where you could see about one to two inches of snow as we go late Monday into early Tuesday. Looking at the seven day forecast out there, expecting mostly dry conditions to start your Monday off. That will transition to a few rain showers late Monday evening into Monday night. Turning cool enough for a brief period of snow showers in the forecast early Tuesday morning. Could see a coating across the region, could see a couple inches across those highest elevations. Really not expecting that to be a major deal out there. Mainly dry Wednesday, Thursday, possibly a few showers or snow showers in the forecast by next weekend.